do you want to see how I created this Carly Bible makeup look? Honestly, it was such a simple look. I thought this was going to take me way longer than it did. But here we are, serving looks with nowhere to go. I think I just want to like go to, oh, I should go get a juice from like a juice shop just so I can go out. <laughs> Stay tuned for the video. Shout out to Ananya Jenna. I hope, I hope I said that right. I don't know if it's Ananya or Anaya. I am so sorry if I mis mispronounced it, but I will put her tag here and I will link her down below. She won how long my skull look took me. It took me four hours and she was correct. So like promised, I was going to shout her out on YouTube. So make sure to follow me on Instagram. If you want to participate in some of my little shout outs and also some giveaways that are coming up again. Um, I also just want to quickly touch on that saying that I am going to be doing something monthly. I can't say what it is just yet as I'm still working on everything, but it will be happening the 1st of July. So make sure to stay tuned to that. I just really want to do this to give back to every single person as much as I can. Um, you know, I really appreciate all of you for supporting me. I don't think you understand how much it means to me. I love and appreciate every single one of you that watch it and comment and subscribe and like and everything. You mean so much to me and I'm just here to try help you because when I was starting out, I had so many questions and there were so many things I didn't know. So I want my channel to be a like for someone, for the younger me to come and hey, come over. Let's Let's do this together. Let's be a team. Let's be friends. Yes. <laughs> so without further ado, let's get to the video. If you like how this video is going, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below and comment what you want to see next. And don't forget to turn on your notifications, that little bell at the top. I have some really exciting things coming. On the 1st of July is when I'm going to be starting my monthly challenge. I'm so excited to do it with you and I really cannot wait for us to do it together. I feel like it's going to be such a great way for all of us to connect and to see how we all do. Oh, it's going to be really fun. It's going to be a fun series. I feel like lately everyone has been very stressed out. I know I have. So I want to do something lightheartedly that we can all participate together and we can all just kind of laugh and also be creative because that's what it's all about. Okay, <laughs> let's get to the video. So I am going to be using, I don't have the Cover FX primer that she used. So I'm going to be using my Professional. I personally love this for my like little blackheads, just to smooth everything out. So we are looking for love. Left. So I'm going to just apply this up. Oh. I am just going to go in with my MAC. Um, foundation. This is NC30. I have ordered some Graftobian because I've heard like such amazing things about it. So I really want to suss it out. So I did order that. Okay. I have a question to ask and please don't even judge, but like, do you clean your brushes all the time? I feel like I clean my brushes like once every Two weeks oh my gosh I feel so bad for even saying that but I don't use all my brushes at once but sometimes when they get full I'm like oh I need to go do a clean so then I'll definitely go do one yeah <laughs> I just feel like my own skin I don't know but I should be just as cautious let's see how long we can clean our brush I'm gonna go clean them now actually for contour today I'm using my LA girl and I'm just gonna be so good to get back to the gym I don't know if your gym is open where you are but we opened on last we opened sorry last Saturday so I made sure to go because as if I'm gonna miss the first day back I wasn't training at all like I'm not even kidding Probably the first two weeks I was doing it because I wanted to like get back into the groove and then like I was going for some walks and I don't know I just kept getting distracted and lazy and especially at home like I just look around and I think I just want to like 
eat. I don't even want to do anything. I just want to eat or like Scarlett will be talking and she'll distract me. Um, <laughs> it's actually like a problem. So I really hope this never happens again because I gained weight. I felt like, no, you know what? You know what? Can I be completely honest? I felt like I lost all my muscle. I didn't gain weight. I felt like I lost everything because I wasn't really like, I was eating kind of the same. I felt like I wasn't really changing my diet that much. And I'm not saying I have the best diet. Please do not think that. I am trying to get a good diet because I want to live a healthy lifestyle. It can be tricky. Anyway, so I finally went back to the gym. Oh, can I just tell you something? You know, I trained legs, what's today? Thursday. I trained legs on Tuesday. It was a struggle for me to sit down on this chair. I'm not even kidding you. Getting up, walking, bending down. Bending down, I feel like how do I even explain this? I feel like my legs, <laughs> oh, I feel like they're like so stiff or they're like jelly and I just can't do anything. It's, oh my gosh, it's the best and worst feeling. I'm so happy it happened because that just shows like I have not trained at all. Like I cannot wait. I felt like I lost so much definition in my, in my booty, literally. Like I, she shrunk. She is like half her size. <sighs> so. Is anyone else training? I've been seeing so many people training, so I'm assuming a lot of gyms are open now, but I know that a lot of places are closed as well. So let me know how you're going. I can't, I personally can't train at home. Let me know. For everyone who does train at home, I bow down to you because I find it very difficult. I love training at a gym. I love going out and I like seeing all the equipment. It just like motivates me, putting my earphones in. Like, I don't really like listening to the music unless my, I'm training with my sister. Then obviously I'm not gonna put my earphones in because that's rude, <laughs> you know? So I'm just going in with some Benet powder. This is the pink one. I love this stuff. It's so good. I'm just going in with the Kat Von D palette and I'm just going to like put through. Wow. That just completely broke. Okay, just going to use the light shade to kind of just go under my eyes a bit. Going in with a big fluffy brush, I'm taking that middle shade, what's left of it now that it broke. How rude, but whatever. I've been trying to find this and I can't find it anywhere, so I'm assuming it's not selling anymore. Do you know? I don't know. I'm just going to set my face with the Gerard setting spray. And this is in lavender. This is one of the nicest smelling sprays. I'm taking the same shade we used for our bronzer from the shade and light. And I'm just going to very lightly be putting that on my eyes. So the funniest thing happened today. <laughs> Me and my sister were training together and we we're doing abs. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Dilemma. Little problem. Can be fixed. It can be fixed. Okay. Freaked out. Anyways. So, yeah, we were training today and um, <laughs> she had a, I'm pretty sure it was like a six kilo ball. You know, the ones that you can hold on the sides. Um, so we were doing like an ab workout, how like you crunch and you go and you crunch and you give the ball to each other. <laughs> and the first set we did, I don't know why I thought we were going to throw the ball because we usually throw the ball. But in saying that we usually have like a way lighter ball. I don't know why she wanted to start off with six kilos. Like I'm like to hello. We just came back starting to the gym. Like it's not even been a full week yet. Relax girl. <laughs> So she got a six kilo ball and I threw it at her <laughs> and I felt so bad, but it was so funny and he got her knees and then she, <laughs> and then she looks at me and she's like, <laughs> her face was priceless. I promise you. She's like, what are you doing? 
And I'm like, aren't we meant to like throw the balls? And she's like, no, she was in six kilos. I swear I was laughing for about a few minutes. And then she's like, my knees, you just broke my knees. I'm like, I'm so sorry. I felt so bad, but you know, what can you do? It is like, I felt, I felt so bad. It was so funny because she just kept saying my knees. <laughs> and that was our first set. <laughs> we still had a whole two other sets. It was, it was hilarious. Shout out to you, Joe. <laughs> Carnival palette, the pro one from Stacey Marie. And I'm going to be taking... I think I'm going to mix Funky in with Pep Talk these two pink shades because she used the neon one and I don't have Huda Beauty's neon one so we're gonna make do with what we have. Is that all over my lid? <laughs> you know what I should do? Hold on. I'm gonna put a little bit of powder and that's gonna catch anything that falls because knowing me there's gonna be some fallout. Just taking this clean blending brush and just gonna quickly blend that out. Just taking the littlest amount. And I'm just gonna like put that around here. Cause um that's where she put it to deepen her. That way. So I'm just gonna be lining my lid. My lid. I'm gonna put liner on using the Tarte. What is this? Just the Tarte liner. Man Eater. I always forget that name. So. Not bad. I am gonna go in with these Ardell lashes. She used ones that were a bit more wispy at the end. These aren't as wispy, but they're pretty cute. So I'm gonna pop these on. Gotta make sure there's no fallout. No, we're good, we're good. <laughs> so, oh, 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 you know when you have a pimple growing underneath your skin? That is happening to me right now. So, am I happy about it? Not really, but what can I do? Not much. Actually, I can do stuff. I'm doing a skincare video, so stay tuned for that. So I'm just gonna cut and do my lower lashes. The same thing we did, the pink and the purple. So I'm going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills. What palette is this one? The Glow Kit Sun Dripped. And I'm using Summer and Moonstone. Just highlight the bridge of my nose. I feel like... That's always a must. I'm also going to do my brows. I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow in soft brown. Just think I'll go a bit lighter because it's a quite cute look. So just brush them up. I tried to do my own eyebrows yesterday, like clean them up. And I clearly didn't do a good job because there are a few hairs missing. I'm just going to be popping some mascara on my bottom lashes. Oh, okay. For blush, I'm going in with the Makeup Revolution palette. And I'm going to take this shade right here. I think it's a really cute shade. So I'm just using like quite a light hand. So, I'm actually going to be using a Dried Cosmetics lip liner in Mudslide. And I'm just going to line my lips. I'm going in with Honey Love from MAC. And You're done. No, I'm joking. Use our finger. And I'm going to marry them together. I have some rhinestones. So she put pink. I have two different shades of pink. So I'm going to actually alternate between 
the light pink and the dark pink for my eyelids. She, I'm just gonna zoom you on. Hey, so she put them just along her lash line where her liner was. So that's exactly what I'm going to do as well. I usually like to dot it from the back of where my lash um, glue is. So I want to attempt to put six. All right, everyone, this is the final result. I feel like Kylie Bible already. She is gorgeous. I love her makeup. It's so like effortless. And she's such an amazing influencer and YouTube creator as well. I've been watching her literally since I was, I was in high school. That was like about nine years ago, eight years ago. So you can say a very long time. She was someone I always looked up to and always inspired me. And I always was just like, I need to like, I love her so much. I want to be like her one day. And you know, you never know. You never know. But she is amazing. And I, yeah, <laughs> I could talk about her all day. Anywho, thank you so much for watching. If you guys like this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Make sure hit that, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Woo. Woo, join the family. Come and join the family. Come on and this adventure and learning curve with us, this learning journey with us. I am so happy to be doing this. I actually love filming for you guys. I feel like I can just talk to you and it just feels great. It feels like I have new family and new friends, which is always something exciting, right? So yeah, so make sure to hit that notification bell as well if you want to be notified every time I have a video, especially for my monthly giveaway. You don't want to miss that. <laughs> it looks like I have no body. <laughs> anyway, thank you again so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this look and I'll see you. When will I see you? Monday, because I'm posting every Monday, Wednesday, Saturday. At what time? 8 p.m. <laughs> Just in case you forgot. Bye. Bye.